So it's a pretty random way to start off this video, but there's a little bird stuck in my garage. <laughs> Just chilling. Um, so originally I saw my garage like two hours ago when I took um, I took the Mercury out just for a little cruise. And originally he was up there just kind of chilling. And I was like, okay, well, maybe he'll leave. So uh, I go out for a little drive, come back, park the car, leave to go with my buddy to uh, go to Chipotle and eat and stuff. Two hours later, come back here. This bird is, I hear a bunch of flapping. I'm like, what is that flapping? It was behind the shelf over here, like down in there. So I got like a stick, I poked it, it walked out, sat on the hood of my infinity, and then flew up there where it's been, uh, I guess, ever since. So, uh, I don't know, hopefully it leaves soon i'm um, just gonna leave the door open uh, see what happens but today's video i'm um, wrapping my intake with this gold heat wrap stuff uh, i already done my heat shield i've already done the heat shield just to kind of test it out and now i'm gonna do the uh, whole actual intake part so uh i'm gonna get that off clean it and uh Go from there. I took the intake out. I just finished cleaning it fully, and uh, now we're ready to go ahead and wrap it. And what I'm going to do is, I'm just going to take, I'm going to take the wrap. If I can get it, go. Wrap it around, and since the intake goes like this on my car, uh, I want the seams like to where it connects when it wraps around at the bottom, so you don't see it. So I'm gonna measure it out, and then once I get the one done, just cut a bunch of them, and then it'll be easy to go ahead and do it. So that's the plan, and uh, I think it should turn out pretty good. There's the uh, finished product. I'm actually pretty happy with it. it. Looks good. So, heat shield is done as well. Yeah, I'm actually pretty happy with that. Now, um, this gold heat shielding stuff. Uh, supposedly, it's supposed to um, block heat, or heat's supposed to bounce off of it to keep your um, intake piping, whatever, uh, cooler. So um, I can't test that. I was too lazy to do a before, you know, a before test today, cause my laptop, it's messed up and I just didn't want to go to the hassle. But I know right, right around how many degrees above or below my car does run from previous, you know, tests and data logs and having it so I can, Log with this one and see if there's really like that big of a difference. Mostly I did it for looks and uh, it's actually gonna look good with my new uh, plenum and stuff that uh, I purchased and have on the way to finally get rid of that kinetics one. So it's all gonna look good. And actually I'm pretty happy with it. And uh, it's hot, I'm sweating. But hope you guys liked that little video. Um, and hopefully I'll have the install video of the uh, plenum and plenum spacer uh, hopefully by the end of this week or maybe next week because I'm still waiting for those parts to come in. Uh, I'm pretty excited to have this car running 100% right, uh, looking better. Got a lot of plans for this summer. So if you guys liked it, hit that thumbs up. If you want to see more, subscribe. See you guys in the next one. Deuces.